seven up three. Picking you up too. Not in the same. <laughs> DB. In the barn. In the barn. When he's born. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> no, this kid's a bad white dancer. No. <laughs> I'm all right. I'm all right, but nothing like y'all. I I gotta see you guys perform. You guys were great, and uh, that's dope. That I didn't know that he actually requested you guys and stuff. That's pretty huge. Yes, that's that's real huge. Um, we had no idea that you know this you know Hollywood paid any attention to our dance community because it's huge, and they probably still have no idea how big it is. It stretches from here to Seattle. You're we talking almost 100 crews in 2008, and five years ago we we had like 20. So um, ever since like MTV. Disney, when they started picking up a lot of our dancers, you know, people got inspired and started branching off into their own thing. And with the success of the Jabberwockies, I think in 2009 there will be twice as many crews around. So it's been really good for our community to kind of expand and kind of get this exposure. So. And one thing I want to say or ask you too is, you know, when the Jabberwockies won won the first season and stuff, it could have easily been over. There's been a lot of reality shows where somebody wins and then. <clears throat> They never become heard of again, but they're doing it big. I mean, BT Awards, music videos, yeah. DVDs, and stuff like that. Does that give you so much hope that you guys could do some of that too? And uh, um, you know, to be honest, because we really are really tight with them, we see them as that's for them. Um, you know, no, I don't mean like competition stuff, but now that there's all these doors opening, where you know, you know, yeah, some yeah. reality shows and stuff, people win, and then you know, like America's Next Top Model and stuff, they win, and then we never really hear. I mean, they might be doing it overseas and right. stuff, but you, you know, you don't really hear from them. And then there's shows like American Idol where they win and they're all over. Right. And so it was so up in the air with with um, you know America's Best Dance Crew, they could go either way, and they're they're making it. And does that give you hope? Like, there's gonna be you know, not taking it from them, but there's going to be opportunities that you guys can do, such as performing at DVD releases and, right. you know, taking it to the next level and stuff. No, absolutely. Um, especially because, like, a crew like the Jabberwockies introduced a very unique style of hip-hop, and there are so many different styles. Uh, they int introduced a unique style to the rest of the world, and, um, you know, we're just a little branch off of that style. So, you know, if, if America likes what, it, what the Jabberwockies do, we're just... Um, kind of a twist in what they do too. So um, that definitely could open doors for, for what we do. Um, and, you know, we'll definitely take any opportunities that come along. Uh, cool. yeah. no. And then I'm going to ask you, how, how was it um, finding out you had to dance, you know, you guys found out what, a week ago and had to put something together. How do you guys make sure that when it comes time and stuff like that, you got it down? Because you only have a week. I mean, I, I think people see you guys perform and are like, oh, that's easy, but let them know like really what goes behind something like that from the point of getting the call to having to perform tonight. Um, late nights, <laughs> long hours, extra rehearsals. Uh, there's no way to get around it. You can't cut corners unless you want to look really bad. You just have to throw down the extra rehearsals, put up with the last minute changes, getting our mix extremely late, you know. <laughs> People, you know, things falling through, it's just, you just got to roll with it and kind of suck it up and have a good attitude because it can't be about it being frustrating for you. It's got to be about the team and what goes on stage. So you just, you just, you know, man up. Or woman up, it's all good. Or woman up. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, there's, there's no secrets. You just work really hard and focus. And then it pays off because yeah. then you guys perform good and then, you know, there were so many, like, talented people here tonight that got to see you guys perform. You guys were on the stage and stuff. There's people from, you know, the execs, the Disneys, the stars, and stuff like that. So you just never know. And then it makes, you know, makes it worth it. Last question. So what I've always wanted to know is, in a dance crew and stuff, you guys, like, perform together, practicing and stuff. When you guys get, in like, in a fight and mad and stuff like that, do you guys have, like, a dance-off? <laughs> Or do they just do that like uh, <laughs> we could do that. You know, that's a good idea. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah. What, I'm cool. trying to think. I'm trying to think the movie and stuff like that. But but where they were like, you know, we're mad at each other. Dance. Oh, wasn't it um, our walk off on um, Zoolander? They would have yeah. model walk off. So I always wanted like dancers like. You ate the last of the Cheetos. <clears throat> Ready? Go. Uh -huh. <laughs> you know, I always wondered if you guys do that. But I guess not, because we got old now. We will now. Yeah. 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 Well, I'm going to see you guys again. I've interviewed you guys a couple times. You guys are in demand and stuff like that. And uh, until we see you again, what's next for you guys? Real quick, one sentence. What's next for you guys? Um, Sacramento in September. Oh, you guys were going to dance, right? No, um, we're close to that, but we're not doing that. Sure, we got family up now. We didn't get no. invited this time, so. It was in the mail, which I lost, but you know, <laughs> I'll, I'll talk. All right, uh, Dance Tag TV here one more time. Tell them who I'm with. 
Super Galactic, Galactic Bee Manipulators. Yeah. And they perform for Step Up 2, the Streets TVB. Step Up 3. So, <laughs> oh, oh, seven, three. You gotta make me double question the movie. <laughs> <laughs> what movie am I here? Bumbleina? No, I'm just kidding. All right. 